Price is right. Bob Barker! Thank you. Thank you very much. Welcome to The Price is Right. The other night I was talking with a gentleman who said that what he likes about The Price is Right is that it has something for everybody, and I think that pretty well sums it up. Right now, I have something for you four. It's this first item up for bids on The Price is Right. It's a bar set. It's the Cadet by Chrome Craft. Enriched vinyl covering on bar and stool, swivel base tools of polished chrome. Now, we round off our retail prices to the nearest dollar, so I'd like to have all of your bids in dollars only, please. I would like to have one bid from each of you, and the one of you who bids nearest to the retail price of that prize without going over wins that prize. Brenda, give me the first bid of this day. What's your bid? Speak a little louder, we can't hear $400 for Brenda. Michelle? $425. Her bid is $425. Elisa? $435. $435. All right, William? $436. $436. Now, the actual retail price is $404, and you've won, Brenda. Brenda is the first winner, and here she is on the stage. What'd you say? <laughs> Now, Brenda, I am going to give you a chance to win another prize. Would you look right back here? This is what you just might win. A new car! <laughs> a new kind of American car, international in design and heritage, with new efficiencies in size, space, service, and operation. The Chevy Chevette by Chevrolet. It's equipped with deluxe bumpers and guards, white striped tires, wheel trim rings, Body side molding and remote sport mirror, Bob. Now, Brenda, we're going to play the card game. Do you know how to play it? I'm, I don't know. Well, I'll explain it. This is a special deck with which we establish how close you must come to the retail price of that car without going over in order to win the car. Draw a card. The best thing that can happen would be for that card to be $1,000. Go ahead. They're numbered 200 through 1,000. And she got $700. That's not bad. Now, there's our marker card right there. That means that you must come within $700 of the retail price of that car without going over in order to win the car. Now, this is your standard deck. Cut the cards if you wish. Each face card in this deck is worth $1,000. Each of the other cards is worth the number on the card in hundreds of dollars, except for the aces. The aces are wild. You can make them anything you want, $1 through $1,000. With this deck, you bid on the car. Now, the first card that you draw is your opening bid. Go right ahead. And she gave me the seven of diamonds, which is worth $700, and we have $700 here as your opening bid. Now, you may continue to draw as long as you wish. You stop when you wish. All you have to remember is that you must come within $700 of the retail price of the car without going over in order to win the car. Now, do you have any questions? No. Go right ahead and draw. And it's a thousand dollars for the ten of spades, making her bid seventeen hundred dollars. What do we do now? Higher. Higher. Draw another card. And she has four hundred dollars more here with the four of clubs. A bid of twenty-one hundred dollars, and the audience wants her to go on. And we add $800 with the aid of clubs, and now her bid is $2,900. And what do you want to do? Uh, uh, Very well, draw another card. She has a two of clubs. That's $200. That's $3,100. Now, you must come within $700 of the retail price of the car without going over. Do you want to go on or do you want to stop? stop. You're going to stop, are you? Very well. She has decided to stop. Her bid is $3,100. She must come within $700 of the retail price of the car without going over to win the car. Has she won? The actual retail price of that car is $3,544. A different time, $444. She's won that car. That is your automobile, Brenda. Congratulations. Yes, she will. You'll drive right up and join the car. Now that's the way to start this show off, isn't it? We'll be looking for another winner after this. Now it's Teresa Butcher.
Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. wrong with Teresa is her total lack of enthusiasm, right? <laughs> Contestants, this is the next item up for bids on The Price is Right. It's a set of luggage. Packed forth by Leeds, a blend of sophisticated styling and utility and exciting fashion ensemble designed to satisfy your luggage needs. Packed forth by Leeds. Teresa, will you please start the bidding on that luggage? $375. $375 brings me to Michelle. $315. Michelle's bid is $315. What's yours, Elisa? $410. $410. All right, William, tell us all about it. $100. How much? $100. $100. Now, the actual retail price is $389, and you've won, Teresa. Teresa has won her way up on stage. for you, Teresa. Now, this may become yours. A Caribbean cruise. We'll fly two of your round-trip air coach from Los Angeles to San Juan, where you'll board a Chandra's cruise departing from San Juan on the magnificent Britannus of Greek registry. This hideaway cruise visits six romantic ports from Chandra's cruises. It's a prize worth $1,502. Now, Teresa, do you know anything about track? Well, race track? Well, no, track, uh, you know, pole vaulting and oh, yeah. sprints uh -huh. and hurdles. You know anything about hurdles? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good for you, because you're going to play the hurdles game. Now, what's the most important thing in running the hurdles? Jumping. To get over oh, the hurdles. Yeah. That's right, exactly. Now, here's your hurdler right here. Johnny, tell us about him before we do anything else. Libby's canned fruit cocktail. When it says Libby's on the label, you know you've got a winner. Now, you see, that's the price. 70 cents. Uh -huh. That's very important for you to remember. In this hurdles race of ours, we have three hurdles. One, two, three. At each hurdle, we have two products. Now, one of those products is more than 70 cents in price. That means this hurdler could not get over that. At each of the hurdles, one of the prices is less than 70 cents, and he'd have no trouble getting over that. So what I want you to do at each hurdle is pick out the price that you believe is less than 70 cents. Now, Johnny, what do we have at hurdle number one? First, Shed gives you great peanut butter flavor in three varieties, smooth, crunchy, and old-fashioned Shed's peanut butter. And Lee and Perrin's sauce, the original Worcestershire sauce, contains only pure natural products. Enhance your recipes with Lee and Perrin's Worcestershire sauce. Now, which of those two is less than 70 cents? The Worcestershire sauce. Very well. Johnny, tell us about the second hurdle, please. For popcorn lovers, it's TV time, pre-measured popcorn oil and salt, everything you need to make delicious popcorn every time. And pure preserves from Knott's Berry Farm with that old-fashioned goodness and natural flavor from Mrs. Knott's original recipe. Now, which of those two products is priced at less than 70 cents? The popcorn. She believes the popcorn is less than 70 cents, and I do hope she's right for the sake of her hurdler. Johnny, what else do we have? Sour cream dips from Kraft in six flavors, from French onion to clam, and all ready for dipping with chips or vegetables. And Boratine Plus, the bleach substitute that's better than bleach because it works on the whole wash. Boratine Plus. Now, which one of those is less than 70 cents? The Boratine. You believe the Boratine is less than 70 cents, and I shall put a pennant right there behind the Boratine. Now, are you ready to start the hurdler on his way? Very well. Here's the starter's gun. Would you like to fire the gun? Mm, now, no. don't. I'm, I'm going to say on your mark, get set, go, and then you fire the gun up <laughs> into the air. Now, don't fire it like they're ready. Are you ready? Uh-huh. On your mark, get set, go. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> now, you got one light. And there he goes. And he got over the first turtle because it's only 43 cents. second hurdle? Yes, he will. It's only 53 cents. He has one hurdle to go, and you are on your way to the Caribbean. Look at him go. 
It's coming higher and higher. Oh, my! Look at that for a team, 95 cents. Now, the audience seemed to be disturbed when you chose the Bora team. Let's see the price of this other product here. It's only 59 cents. That's the one you needed. But, Teresa, you're a great starter anyway. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, that is... Beg your pardon. That is the first game, and the second game follows this. To have another contestant now, this studio audience, if you please. Right on, Bob. Where is Wendy Freeman? Come on down! You're the next contestant on The Price is Right! <laughs> Wendy is in place and coming round the mountain is the next item up for bids on The Price is Right. It's a fireplace! The freestanding fire drum is designed for beauty as well as warmth. It's made to burn either wood or coal. It can be the bright spot of any room. And Wendy has only arrived on the scene, and I'd like to have your bid on that. Two seventy. Two hundred and seventy dollars, and now Michelle. Four fifteen. Four hundred and fifteen dollars, Alicia. What do you bid? What was her bid? Her bid is four fifteen, and Wendy's bid is two seventy. Four twenty. Four hundred and twenty dollars. Now, William, it is your bid. I'm sorry. What was uh, the? The bids are two seventy, four fifteen, and four twenty. Four thirty. Four hundred and thirty dollars. And the actual retail price is five hundred and ninety-five dollars. And William, you are a winner. Will you follow me, William? We're going right back here. Are you with me, William? Here you are. William here on his chest has Pennsylvania University, but actually you go to school out here in California where? Uh, West Los Angeles College. And you are studying theater, you said? Yes, I am. And what do you want to do? Act. I want you to do a little acting right now. Show me great happiness. Wow! Very good. Now, show me, show me great sadness. Oh, no. Yes, you're very good. Now, we're going to have one of those two emotions in just a moment. Because you will or you will not win these two prizes. May we see them, please? A brass day bed and a refrigerator. First, from sunshine brass beds in typical French elegance of pure brass. Here's a true conversation piece with practicability for any room from sunshine brass. And second, a refrigerator. A Mana's ESR-16 energy-saving refrigerator having three inches of urethane foam insulation in the cabinet walls using far less electricity and a Mana exclusive. Now, William, we call this game One Right Price, and $770 is the one right price for one of those two prizes. You tell me which one, and you win them both. The bed. You say the bed is $770. And you are right. It is $770, so you get the refrigerator freezer, which is $520. Now, I want to see great happiness. No! There you are, William. Thank you for playing one right try. Now, we have played three games, and we're going to have our showcase showdown number one after this. Spinning the big wheel in the first showcase showdown of our show because they won their way up on stage in the first half of our show. And Brenda here has won a new automobile. Yes. That's exciting, yes, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> and William has won a bed and a refrigerator freezer, and that's exciting, isn't it? You better believe it. And you tripped, <laughs> and you tripped over the third hurdle, didn't yeah. you, Teresa, <laughs> in the hurdle game? But things can pick up for you right now. You could win a little money. Not just a little money, you can win a lot of money. How? You can get this wheel to stop on exactly one dollar in one spin or a combination of two spins, in which case you win one thousand dollars in cash. One thousand dollars in cash. Now, the one of you who is nearest to one dollar without going over will be in the showcase at the end of the show, and of course in that showcase you could win all sorts of beautiful prizes. If you go over in this game that we're going to play, you're out of the game, so don't do that. Teresa, it's your spin first. Will you step over to the wheel? And spin away. 
And Teresa spun that as if maybe she is just a little angry about the hurdles, Jane. Teresa, there are some good numbers coming up here, like 95 cents. Ooh, that would be a good one. Or 85 cents. And you got it. You got a, you have 85 cents. You want to stop? Yeah. I don't blame you one bit. That was a very good spin. Our current leader has 85 cents. But here's William, the actor. Step over there, William. Now, before you spin, I want you to look right into this camera and display great confidence. Look confident. Very good. Now spin the wheel. Here he goes. Confident that he will end up with $1,000. He has to be 85 cents to get into the showcase. Well, he hasn't beat 85 cents on this spin. He's ended up with 35 cents, so spin it again. You have a maximum of two spins. 35 cents in his first spin. What will William get in this spin? 35 cents plus. Look at this 65 cents coming down here. Look at this. Six yeah. And now. <laughs> now, William. He did it. He gave us that confident look, and then he did it. Now, we have seen you display happiness. We have seen you display ha sadness, and we've seen confidence. Now, with $1,000 to your credit, I want you to look directly into this camera and look the, the look of a very wealthy man. There he is. There's great wealth. Brenda, your spin. Your spin. See if you can win $1,000, too. William is standing over there with $1,000. You have to time and we'd have a spin off and you get a thousand dollars too. Now this is going to be your first spin. And what do you have in your first spin? You have 55 cents. Spin it again. Now she's after 45 cents. Here we go. 45 cents with her 55 cents. And we here comes the 45 cents. Will it stop on the 45 cents? It 45 cents, 55 cents, you won a thousand dollars. Now, step over here. There you are. William, come back here now. You have a thousand dollars, but you're in a spin-off. Now, don't think of this as an opportunity or a, or a situation in which you may not win your way into the showcase. Instead, think of this as a situation in which you can win an additional thousand dollars. Spin that wheel. You could win another thousand. Here we go now. One spin and one spin only for each of you. The one who is nearest to one dollar will be in the showcase at the end of the show. Now here's William's first spin, or his only spin in the spin-off, and it's going to be 70, 70 cents. All right. That's a good spin. 70 cents it is. Now, Brenda, you get one spin. One chance to beat 70 cents. One chance to win your way into the showcase. Let's see what she does with that one chance. 70 cents is William's score. 70 cents is what she's trying to beat. Here comes 75 cents. Here it comes. Is it going on to 70? Oh! It did. You beat him by one nickel. Thank you, William. And here is Brenda. She'll be in the showcase of Pearson Games. But before we do, Johnny, we have to have a fourth contestant down here. All right, Bob, how about Larkin Coach? Come on down, you're the next contestant on The Price is Right. Hello, Larkin. Will all four of you take a look at the next item up for bids on The Price is Right? It's a microwave oven. The Amana Touchmatic Radar Range, the first microwave oven with a memory. You can program it to cook, simmer, or defrost as simple as one, two, three, the Amana Touchmatic Radar Range. Bid on that oven, Larkin. $345. $345. Wendy, what's your bid? $400. $400. Now, Michelle, would you give me your bid, please? $465. $465. Alisa? 
500. $500 even. Now, the actual retail price of the oven is $595. Alicia owns the oven. And here comes Alicia. Here comes Alicia. Right up here. Now, Alicia, you have that beautiful oven for your home. You have your horseshoe in your hand. And you have an opportunity to win one of these two prizes. A compactor or a new car. The 1976 Chevrolet Nova Sedan, the latest edition of the most popular compact for the size price of added, is right for many families. The Chevrolet is equipped with deluxe bumpers and guards, turbo hydromatic transmission, white striped tires, outside mirror, body side molding, AM radio, and power windows. Or second, a compactor. From Roper. A trash compactor with powerful ram action that compacts cans, bottles, and other trash into a round, easy-to-handle package. And either this new car or this compactor can be yours if the price is right. Look at this game coming around here, will you? One of the most exciting games we play. Alisa, there are four spaces beside that car for the price of that car in dollars. There are three spaces beside that compactor for the price of that compactor in dollars. As I said, you may win the car or the compactor, but if you don't win one of those, you get the money in the piggy bank, and these three spaces are for that money in dollars and cents. Now, each digit, zero through nine, is on the board, but each one is there only once. I want you to give me a number. We'll light it up wherever it is. You continue to give me numbers until you light these, and you get the car, or these, and you get the compactor, or these, and you get the money in the piggy bank. What's your first number? Four. Her first number is four. Gentlemen, where is number four? There it is. It's the first number in the price of the car. Six. Now she wants the six. Let's give her the six. And we have it down there in the piggy bank. Nine. Number nine is Elisa's choice. Let's give Elisa number nine. Good. Another number in the price of the car. Now we have only two numbers up there that are vacant. A one. One. She wants the one. Here comes the one. And now we have only the last space in the price of the car. That car, Elisa, is 4,190 what? Lucky seven. Lucky seven, she says. Show us the seven. No, that's down there in the piggy bank. Now, Elisa, be careful. There's only one space left in that piggy bank. Five. She wants the five. Where is number five? There it is. She's got five. Alicia, you own that handsome automobile. Yeah. You own that car. Let me show the audience what you have in your hand there. Look at that. You see her little horseshoe? She had that in her hand, and it worked. Congratulations, Alicia. We have given away $2,000. We have given away two automobiles, and there's more prices right coming up. Stay tuned for more pricing games and the fabulous showcases which are coming up on the second half of The Price is Right. $1,000 bills were in a hot streak. Anything can happen now. Johnny, do your thing. Abraham Ganim, come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. said anything could happen now, and it did. We have Abraham with us now. Nice to see you, Mr. Bob Parker. It's nice to see you, Abraham. From, from all my friends from Bolivia, South America, hello to you. Well, <laughs> from all of my friends in the great state of South Dakota, hello right back at you, Abraham. Hey. Thank you. Now, let's play. Here's the next item up for bids the price is right. It's patio furniture. From Scandinavian outdoor living, a patio group featuring a cocktail height table plus four armchairs with royal blue cushions. The style is crisp and clean. The finish is durable acrylic. From SOL Incorporated. Abraham, what do you bid on that prize? $285. $285. Larkin? $425. $425. Wendy? 
$315. Michelle, give me your bid. $450. Her bid is $450, and the actual retail price is $724. Michelle is done. She's the last of our first four contestants, and she has won her way up on stage. You did it, Michelle. You finally made it. And now, Michelle, you're here, and you have a chance to win this. A new game room! First, there's air hockey. The Brunswick Air Hockey Game has the speed, excitement, and action of ice hockey. This three-by-six-foot space-saving model gives players a chance to test both offensive and defensive skills. Next, a billiard table. From Murray and Sons, this is the El Grande model, a slate face covered in rich red felt from Murray and Sons. And to complete your game room, this game carpeting. 30 square yards of big casino carpeting from Cal Craft Carpets, a replica of Crafts and Blackjack tables tufted of rugged Anzo nylon fiber. Big casino by Cal Craft. This is a prize package worth $1,797. And nothing would please me more than to have you win that prize package in the shell game. Take your place right here at the end of the counter. Will you please, Michelle? I'll do one quick shuffle here, and we'll get down to the business of winning that prize package. Now, you have to win some chips, and you win those playing a game with these prizes. Johnny, what's the first one? It's a match set of Regal's decorated harvest aluminum waterless cookware with Teflon 2 and matching polyperk coffee maker, all from Regal Ware. And on this, we have a price, $53, which is wrong. Is the right price higher or lower? Higher. He says higher. Let us see. No, it's lower. Now, you don't win that, but you may win this. Listen. A Service Master First Aid Kit helps keep your carpet spotless. Service Master's do-it-yourself carpet cleaning now available from the cleaning people who care. And Miss Pennington, what's the wrong price? $11. Is the right price higher or lower? Higher. She says it is higher. Show us. She's right. She gets the chip. Put it beside one of the chefs. Very good. Now, Johnny, let's hear about prize number three. Right, it's a true test waffle baker and grill. Snap in Teflon grid easily converts this waffle baker to a grill exclusively from True Value Hardware Store. And the wrong price is $26. Is the right price higher or lower? Higher. She says it is higher, and she is right. It's higher. There you are, tip number two. Okay, Johnny, what do we have now? New pulsating water massage from Polonex, featuring four shower heads in one. Let you dial how you want to feel, installs easily in minutes. And this price is $37. Is the right price higher or lower than $37? Lower. She says it is lower. Turn it around. No, it's higher. Well, it looks to me like you have every other one, so I would suggest I just start here and we find out how well you've done, okay? Okay. All right, if it's here, you lose. But it's not here. That's good. If it's here, you win. But it's not there. That's bad. Now, if it's here, you lose. If it's here, you win. Is it here? No, you must win. It's there. And there you are, Michelle. Congratulations. Very good. We're just having winners all over the place, aren't we? Let's see if we can keep up this mad pace after this. Here in Contestants Row, you brought me greetings from all the people in Bolivia, so I assume you're from Bolivia originally. Well, uh, not that uh, I am uh, uh, born in Bolivia. I am born in Argentina. Uh, my uh, parents uh, changed the place, and it went to Bolivia, South America. And I left Argentina when I am six years old. And now I am Bolivian citizen. But you live here now. Well, now I live here for, uh, <laughs> oh. Well, I, I, I live here 13 years in, in, uh, in Los Angeles. Ladies and gentlemen. Only, only place I know from the United States. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to This Is Your Life with Abraham here. Yeah. You. you started in Argentina. You lived in Bolivia, now you live here. Yeah, right. Well, it's our good fortune in the United States to have you with us, Abraham. And who's going to join them in contestant throws, Johnny? That is going to be Thomas Valletta. Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. Well, 
Welcome aboard, Thomas. How long have you lived in the United States? All my life. Have you? 31 oh. years. 31 years. Very good. We know all about you, too, now. <laughs> Here's the next item up for bids and the price is right. It's a grandfather clock. <laughs> a beautiful grandfather clock, the Casablanca. Solid oak, glass size, genuine West German Westminster movement, which chimes every quarter hour and strikes the hours from Concerto. Thomas, would you please tell us what you'd like to bid on that? Uh... $850. $850. Abraham? $880. $880. Now you, Larkin. $890. $890. And now Wendy is up to you. What was those again? The bids are $850, $880, and $890. $900. $900. $900. No, there's the buzzer. You've all overbid. Now, the lowest bid that we have is $850, so we know we must bid lower than $850. Did you hear me, Larkin? Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Erase these bids, please. And, Thomas, you start. $650. $650. Abraham? $595. $595. And now, Larkin? Thomas, $650. $595. $670. $670. Wendy, it's your bid. $675. $675. And the actual retail price is $700. You won, Wendy. Right over here. Wendy, you're a winner. We're going to play the range game now. And in the range game, you have a chance to win this. A Louis the 16th debt. Imported from France. This elegant desk is a Louis XVI reproduction made of solid walnut with hand-tooled leather writing surface. Now, all you have to do is tell me the price of that beautiful desk within a range of $150, and you own the desk. Now, it's more than $1,800, and it's less than $2,400. Our $150 range finder will move up the scale when you believe the price of the prize is in the colored area. Press this button. It's as simple as that. If you're right, you win. Step over by the board. Don't press the button until you want to stop the range finder. Gentlemen, will you start that up the scale for Wendy, please? Now, it does not have to be in the middle. It can be any place in the colored area. I've had contestants win by as much as just a, a dollar or two. You've stopped it. Step right back here now. And in that dark strip of blue right along here, the price will appear. Light up that price. Ooh, it's clear up there, $2,250. Wendy, thank you for playing the range game. Bye-bye. Now, showcase... And I think you'll agree we had a lot of excitement around here. We had two out of three contestants win $1,000 bills spinning this wheel. What they did was to have this wheel end up on $1, and for that, they received a cash bonus of $1,000. Now, the contestant who is nearest to $1 without going over wins a place in the showcase. And the three contestants who will spin the wheel are right here beside me. We have Elisa, who's the top winner in this half of our show. We have Michelle, and we have Wendy here. Now, each of you will spin once. If you wish, you may spin it a second time, knowing that if you go over $1, you're out of the game. Knowing that if you're nearest to $1, you're in the showcase. Knowing that if you get exactly $1, you win a $1,000 bill. Knowing all that, Wendy, step over there and spin that wheel. Good luck, Wendy, is right. Here we go, into the second showcase showdown. Will we be giving away some more $1,000 bills? I see a 90 cents coming up here, or a 70 cents right here, and there you are. Now, do you want to spin again or stand on 70 cents? I'm going to... You're going to go again? Is that what you said? Very well, she's going to spin again. She's going to live dangerously. 70 cents is a pretty high number to take your second spin. 70 cents plus five. Well, you improved it by one nickel. 75 cents. I think you got out of that rather fortunately, actually. 75 cents is the score for our current leader, and Michelle, we're ready for you to spin the wheel. Here we go. It must go all the way around at least once in order to be a spin. You have to be 75 cents to be in the showcase. 
You have to get one dollar to win one thousand dollars. Going a little fast, here's 80 cents. Spin it again, you have 35 cents there. 35 cents, and here's your second spin. 65 cents and 35 cents add up to exactly one dollar, and that will be worth one thousand dollars to you. 35 cents, plus what she gets in this spin is her score. 35 cents and 90 cents is a dollar and a quarter, and that's 25 cents. Too much. Now, Lisa, it's your wheel. There you go. You know what you have to do. Spin it. What you have to do is beat 75 cents to get into the showcase. You don't want to look? All right. You just keep your eyes closed, and I'll tell you exactly what's happening. The wheel has burst into flame. It's being destroyed behind you. You have 25 cents in your first spin, so take your second spin. 25 cents, and you know that you have to beat 75 cents to get into the showcase. 25 cents in the first spin, and she's watching this time. She's kissing her horseshoe here this time. And she's going to end up with 25 cents plus all oh, the dollar came to play. Wendy, that means you're in the showcase with your 75 cents. And of course, the showcase will be the very next thing we do after this. You are the top winner in the showcase, and what a day you've had already. You won a new car, didn't you? Yes. And you won $1,000. Yes. And you won the bar set, too. What What about it? What, what is the most you ever won before? Well, I won today. Nothing else. You've never won anything no. else? No. Well, then this must be a day you'll never forget. What are you going to do with $1,000? Pay the taxes on the car. <laughs> That's a very good thought. Yes. The IRS will appreciate that. And, Wendy, you're the runner-up here in the showcase, and I hope that both of you watched our show enough to know what that means. It means that each of you will have a showcase of beautiful prizes to bid on, and the one of you who bids closer to the retail price of her own showcase without going over will win all the prizes in the showcase. But if you are the winner and you are less than $100 away from the retail price of your own showcase, then you will win everything in both showcases. And we've had so much happiness already on this show. What with two cars given away and $2,000 bills, that could very well happen to just wind this whole thing up in a blaze of glory. Now, Brenda, I want you to take a look at the first showcase. Bid on it if you wish, or pass it to Wendy. Wendy, Brenda, this is the first showcase. Something for every room in the house. First, for the bedroom, this round bed. A glamorous, exciting seven-foot round bed featuring smooth inner spring comfort and a luxurious simulated first spread from Oklahoma Furniture Manufacturing Company. Next, for the kitchen, this range. Caloric automatic pilotless ignition self-cleaning gas range. No pilots in either oven or broiler. Saving energy and fuel costs. Furnace light automatically. Pilotless ignition from Caloric. And for the family room, this stereo. Surround yourself with ornamental design and music with this main cabinet and Allegro speaker cabinet. Four channel power amplifier, AM, FM stereo, FM tuner amplifier, and stereo precision record changer by Zenith. And for the living room, a sofa. The Gladiator, an eight-foot sofa from Towncraft. The styling is bold country American with campaign accents, and the fabric is a shiny vinyl in shades of rust and brown. And finally, for the garage, a motorcycle. The Benelli Phantom boasts a 250cc five-speed twin-cylinder motor. For many happy miles of motorbike touring, is from Benelli. And this showcase can be yours if the price is right. Well, the first thing that we must establish is whether this showcase is Brenda's or Wendy's. How about it, Brenda? You're the one who will decide. <laughs> it's Wendy's showcase, is it? Wendy, what do you bid on your showcase? $2,600. $2,600 is her bid. Now back to Brenda. And Brenda, this is your showcase. A new living room! <laughs> California Country by S.X. Graham Company, featuring hand-laid parquet trimmed with metal that highlights the natural grains and characteristics of Ponderosa Pine. 
And under all this lovely furniture, there's carpeting. 40 square yards of Galaxy's Windsong carpeting with revolutionary new Future Step backing. Quieter, more durable, and there's no need for separate padding from Galaxy. And to keep your carpets looking new, this cleaning system. Wallvax, central vacuum cleaning system installs as easily as a medicine chest. Perfect for mobile homes, apartments, and houses, including accessories from Wallvax. And for your family's entertainment, this home entertainment center. The Zenith Michelangelo 25-inch color picture with stereo unit of selected hardwood and veneer finish, the Michelangelo. And this showcase can be yours if the price is right. Brenda, what did you fit in your showcase? Um, 46. $4,600 is her bid. Now, Wendy, your bid on your showcase is $2,600, and the actual retail price of your showcase is $4,138, a difference of $1,538. Now, Brenda, you must be close to the $1,538 without going over to win your showcase. Your bid is $4,600, and Brenda, the actual retail price of your showcase is... $4,154. You've gone over and Wendy wins. Wendy is the winner. And I think she's positively happy about the whole thing. Yes. Wendy, congratulations. Bob Barker saying goodbye, everybody. <laughs>